are you doing this? I could just kill you here. But the boss likes to play this little guessing game with the splatter marks on the pavement. Wait, how is he still talking? <laughs> Had him in a choco. How in the world is he talking? Who are you? I'm here to help. There are more of them. They have my co-workers. They're... they're forcing them. Don't worry. I'll get to them before anything happens. Okay. Hurry! Almost there. Wonder how many floors is in this building. Like, my goodness, we just keep going up. Oh, I thought it was gonna be an enemy right there. All right. I've never seen anything like this. These bombs are set to detonate December 31st. I should be able to disarm them with my cryptographic sequencer. God, I had to fight while the cat while they had a uh, that camera footage happening. I thought it was a cutscene for just them to do, but oh wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. When Vicky Bell was talking. I almost did control Batman. Oh come on! I'm like I'm hitting. Why? Why is not countering? Get electrocuted! Get out of my face! Nope, nope. Let's go. Get head, but. Yeah, all right, here's when things get interesting. After this fight scene here. Oh, wait, hold up. Oh, these are Bane's men right here. Okay, okay. First was the Joker's guys. Now this is Bane guys. Oh, wait. Oh, I, w I didn't want to. Hold on, I wanted to go to the other guy. The camera messed it up for me. Let's get down to business. I'm trying to handle this big guy, but all the small fry keep trying to hit me. One at a time. One at a time. Oh, come on. Stay down. Oh, here we go. Here we go. This will help. Come on. Come on. Now. Hurry up. Hurry up. Before electric uh, shot gloves go off. Nope. I hit Y. I hit the counter button. Let's go. Alright. Here's where things get real interesting. Yeah, I'm 
just seen the explosion of the Gotham Royal on the news. The hotel guests, are they safe? Not now, Alfred. Sir, are you all right? Your voice... I'm fine, Alfred. I've dealt with psychopaths before, but this... Sir, I strongly suggest you call in Captain Gordon. He could be a valuable ally for you. I don't need any allies. Yeah, well, he felt differently when Robin, Nightwing, and Batgirl came along. Oh, I forgot about this part. Okay. I see the Joker's men here have been eliminated. Good work. But remember, our primary objective is the Bat. We must remain vigilant. He will not get past us. And this is the only way to the penthouse. We can hope you're right. But only time will test your words. You know, we've been coming. up here waiting for your boss, Bay, and then jumped into this huge pile of money once. Not once! You know what's crazy is the I fact that the Bane's enemies, uh, I mean Bane's henchmen killed Joker's guys. See, Bane was, <laughs> Bane has his own agenda. He can care less about the Joker. Here we go. Time to meet the big boys. Thank God, too, because I'm tired of fighting these henchmen. I'm honestly not even looking at the words <laughs> that I have to put together. I'm just waiting for it to say accept. Drop in <laughs> and just in time. Oh, he's my parasol. <laughs> Remember, you gave your word. You have one minute. Do they even have manners where he comes from? <laughs> you see. It's a tradition in my house to open one present each on Christmas Eve. Hmm. How about this one? <laughs> and a party in a pantry. How many lives did you just take? None, I think. That was just a little stalking stuffer. A construction site blocking my view. <laughs> but this one isn't. I've long waited. For this moment, with your death, I will find peace. And now, the moment you've all been waiting for, I present to you the death of the Batman. I begin to think oh man! Let us see what you hold can up, hold do. up. All right, how you fight Bane again? I was trying to team like the other big guys. Hold up. Oh, okay, that is how you do. It. I was trying to do that the first time. Here we go. All right, hold on, hold on, hold on. Get back, get back. Oh, I thought he was about to do something. Nope, nope. Oh. Your technique is predictable. Oh, I can counter that. Okay, I gotta remember that. When he grabs back, I can counter it.
break one of those. Break one of those. Let's go. Come on, come on, come on. Let's go, Bane. Come on, you're known for breaking the bat. Oh, wait, wait. Crazy to think how Batman don't want any help. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Oh, whoa, whoa, hold up, hold up, hold up. I forgot about this. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. I think, yeah, Bane's minions come too. I gotta be careful of that. Alright, what is he about to do? Me too stirring, not even a... Well, that was stirring, but a few more blows to the head and he won't be anymore! <laughs> when I'm done with him, coming for you, Payasaro! Why do these minions have to interfere? Let it be between, be between me and Bane! Like, we all know in the comic books, Bane would not have his minions help him. It'll be between Batman and Bane. <laughs> So hard it hurt me. Come on, come on, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. But yeah, they the game to the kept it, you know, between Batman and Bane. Bane would not ask for help. Oh cool, I got my electric gloves. Here we go. Man, these stupid minions. It's funny how Joker's just up there enjoying the show. Alright, time to run, time to run! Oh! Come on, run over your minions here so I don't have to fight them. Oh, man, hold up, hold up. Not at the cost of me dying, though. Alright, there we go, let's go. Let's go, me and you, me and you. Looks like this is it. It was nice knowing you. Actually, no, it was Come on, minions, stay out of this. Between me and Bane. One on one. Uh. Come on, come on, come on, come on. I'm trying to keep hitting Bane to there we go. I'm trying to keep hitting Bane so that way I can get that life down. That should be it, right? Oh, one more, one more. Here we go. Come on, hit your minions. Hit your minions over here. Oh, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Wow, he didn't hit one. Oh, here we go. Wait, I can't move. Oh. You just ran out of time.
trying to kill you! Those were two very, very bad men. Ooh, the things they've done. You really don't want to know. They deserved death. <laughs> Just like me. <laughs> Freeze! Don't move, freak! I think he's talking to you. Take him down! Let me guess. He got away. Take him to Blackgate. Where'd he go? Huh? The bat! The partner! <laughs> My partner? Who else would jump off a building to save your sorry ass? You know, officer! <laughs> I was wondering the same thing myself. Welcome to Blackgate. We're gonna do a quick psychiatric evaluation. Bad day, huh? Cops in this city. Always beating on the sick and defenseless. Tell me something, dear. Have you ever had a really bad day? And what do you mean by that? You of all people should know. There's nothing so cruel as memory. The pointy bitey little thunderbolts and wanted party crashes screaming for your synapses. Inescapable, unrelenting, not at all friendly. You can't even escape into madness. And then you meet someone who changes your life. And you feel that you don't even know who you are anymore. Isn't it funny how one little encounter can cleave off little pieces of your past, deform your memories and persona until you rethink your whole identity? <laughs> and as you realize how foolish it all is, <laughs> your laughter reverberates off the walls of your own. Okay, I'm gonna need more specifics. How about we try some word association? That sounds... delightful. <laughs> okay, one more. And I need you to be serious for this one. Fate. <laughs> you wanna know something funny? I used to think of fate as evil, predetermined not by some higher power, no, but by the rules of human nature. But tonight, it's all changed. What's changed? Have you ever had the feeling that your entire life has been building towards this one moment? Is that how you feel? <laughs> well, now, yes. Now I realize that all the battles, the bad days, the brutalities. It was all the hand of fate at work. So now you see fate differently? <laughs> Absolutely. Now I understand there are no chance encounters. It was all meant to be. Everything leading up to who I've met tonight. So you've met someone special? Yes. 
And you might say it's changed everything. Everything? Absolutely. I mean, do you realize what a wild world we live in? How lonely it is to wade through all that wretch and filth on your own? It is kind of lonely, isn't it? Of course. Of course you understand. Even in a crowd of other screwballs, <laughs> you're so alone that you can kick, claw, yell, scream at the top of your lungs. No one cares. It's like you don't even exist. I feel... Sometimes I feel like I'm trapped on this path leading nowhere. To just emptiness. Now, now you feel like you've got someone by your side. To share the journey with you. And how does that make you feel? I feel adrift, floating, like someone's pulled the stopper on my reality, and I'm sucked down the drain into something new. It's all very exciting, really. <laughs> you wouldn't know what that feels like, I'm sure. I might. Can you tell me more about how this person makes you feel? It's like meeting someone I can actually relate to. Which, believe me, dear, I've never felt before. <laughs> you understand. You're someone who's not afraid to let go and fall. <laughs> Free falling, and I didn't pack a shoot. <laughs> do you know what I mean? Yes. Yes, I do. I figured you would. So, may I ask, who is this person? Oh, someone very, very special. But whose real name I don't even know yet. Uh, my name's Halleen. Halleen Quinzel. What a pretty name. Do your friends call you Harley? Oh, uh, I don't have a lot of friends. Well, Harley, you got one now. a bit anticlimactic, but I hoped you might finally be ready to celebrate Christmas Eve, now that the Joker's behind bars. Bane is still out there. I've got to locate the signal from the tracker I placed on him. Even you must eat, sir. If you hadn't called the police, he'd already be in custody. This man, this is Delta 47. You know, I made a promise of my own to your parents. No sign of any casualties. Not now, Alfred. Put the story back to the precinct. What is he that? Found bombs under the foundation. Some kind of hopped up freak. Must have been 400 pounds of muscle. Took six cops to gun that bastard down. Yeah, I saw the body in the morgue. Couldn't believe it. Sounds like this could be Bane or one of his men. If I hurry to the GCPD morgue, I can inspect the body and the autopsy report. Well, before you leave, I've run some tests on the compound you found at the steel mill. Looks like a match for your globular projectile for non-lethal restraint. You mean the glue grenade? 
Indeed. The resin has finished curing. It's at your workbench. Of course, I'd recommend testing it here in the lab before you go. But I'm sure you won't listen to me. You never do. 